Next I'm going to be adding a K37 wireless keypad. Uh, to open the keypad, you will see you can put in a screwdriver and jam it at the bottom so that you can slide it down and it will come apart at the back plate. First then you will see there's a plastic tab where the batteries is fitted in. You can also fit a PA6 adapter to this keypad to permanently power it with a transformer key. Uh, but to open this, take a screwdriver, unscrew it. this separator and the tip that will come on. Okay once your keypad is working you will see it's not communicating with the panel. Now one main thing you must do is when you're adding a wireless keypad you can either add it in the programming with the serial number or once the power panel is powered up there will be a 10 minute window that you can add your wireless keypad now to do that I'm still within the 10 minute window of the powering up the, the control panel so you hold in the circle key, the on off and the bypass keys you can hold in and press simultaneous give it some time you will see there's a lot of flashing going on there and once it's registered it will show you the information on your control panel. From here you can still do all the functions, um, arm your system, disarm it and all that functions you can still do from here. Arm the system, it will tell you everyone is armed, it's busy counting down.